The only way to keep your health is to eat what you don't want, drink what you don't like, and do what you'd rather not. This line was quoted by a 19th century American writer humorist called Mark Twain, who wrote legendary novels such as The Adventures of Tom Sawyer in 1876. This is Quoting Quotes, and I am your host Lord Eridor. In this video series, I will be presenting and examining peculiar and famous or infamous quotes from different people, genres, medias, and circumstances, and see what we can learn from them. As the father of American literature, he is considered as one of the greatest humorists America has ever produced, and his works stand out in his time for much of his social commentaries and criticisms to the extent where some of his works have been subjected to censorship. The quote is a short extract from his 1897 non-fiction social commentary title following the equator. Though this book is a social commentary centered around his criticism against racism, the oppression of British imperialism, and religious intolerance, I will take the quote as it is and try to appreciate it as it is and apply it to the general context of life. Sweet and pleasurable things are not always good for a person. This is especially so when we drown ourselves in our own indulgence and thereby destroying ourselves. And it doesn't just mean our physical health, but also our mental and spiritual condition. Like what it says in a quote, you must generally do the kind of things that we'd rather not. The most obvious contrast is between exercising and slouching, work and play, being courageous and being cowardly, and of course, eating healthily and eating junk food. There is a saying among traditional herbalists that the more bitter the medicine, the better it is for you to regain your health. I know I digress, but the point is this. No pain, no gain. It is as simple as that. Ask any gym instructor and he she will probably tell you that if you want to start losing that extra pound, you have got to put in the effort and sacrifice that which is most pleasurable to you, meaning sweet, sweet calories. The basic principle that we can learn from this quote is universal and therefore can be applied to many different situations. Want to lose the pounds? Exercise. Want to get the desired results which is good for your well-being? Work. Want to get the thing that you so desire? Have some courage to pursue it. Life is not a bed of roses. Sometimes you have to make your own bed and then throw some roses on it. But to do that, you've got to put in the effort that you'd rather not because it is so hard to do. Have the will to say no to that which is bad for you so that you can gain that which is truly good for you. Have the will to say yes to the hard and horrible things that is good for you in the long run. Have a go at it and remember, no pain, no gain. I hope you did take something positive from this short video. Tell me what you think. Is there anything I missed out? Are there any requests for quotes that you would like me to talk about? Please do comment below. If you like this video, please share it with your friends and do consider leaving a like on this video and subscribe to this channel for more quoting quotes. This is Lord Aerodor. Be good and kind and positive to each other.